I came across this cowboy cooking channel the other day. Me and my wife were looking for something uh, new to try. And there's this guy. Uh, he was dressed like a cowboy. He had a cowboy hat, uh, vest, you know, everything that looks like a cowboy. I don't know if he was a cowboy, but he just bought his stuff at the cowboy store. But he did a video uh, strictly on, on how to make hash browns. And uh, it was a decent video. I mean, it was well produced. It was, it was good. He did it in his own kitchen. And uh, we actually tried the hash browns later on. It was good. The thing that, that struck me odd was that, well, it wasn't really odd. Uh, the video was six years old, but it had seven and a half million views on it. Seven and a half million views, which is awesome. I mean, he must be doing something right. So um, I think what I'm going to do in this channel, I'm going to switch from doing uh, sci-fi fantasy art to cooking. Uh, I'm going to start, you know, looking at eggs and bacon. And he had a, a video on how to make cowboy coffee. I didn't watch it, but maybe I should. And uh, I, I think I'm in the wrong genre, the wrong niche. So I think cooking is probably where I'm going to go. Even though my wife's a much, much better cook than I am, I could probably fake it. But uh, I don't know how what else to do to get this channel going. So maybe I could fix it so I have um, uh, cooking and fantasy art. So what am I going to do with this particular video? Now, I did do uh, a painting tutorial on how to paint uh, chickens. And these chickens, I actually shot, the, I shot a picture down at the fair. It's my own photo that I rendered into a painting. And I call it folk chickens. I don't know why, because it sounds folksy. You like my hat? It's kind of cool. This is back when I was doing um, live streams uh, on the guitar. Anyway, so um, I'm going to attach that video here and see if I can, you know, maybe find a genre like country chickens or country this or something else, because obviously this stuff's just not working. I don't understand why it's not working. I think that people would find this funny. If you like Godzilla movies, if you like uh, fun horror movies and that kind of stuff, I would think my channel would be right up your alley. But uh, either that or YouTube just sending my stuff to the wrong people. And I think they are. I've, I've seen some of the places where they send my stuff. And it has absolutely nothing to do with what I'm doing at all. Um, I think YouTube is, is drastically broken or something. I mean, after I, this is my 198th video. 198 and I have 103 subscribers so somebody's doing something wrong so from now on it's going to be how to make a hash browns and eggs and pancakes and cowboy coffee and I'll have to go out and rent a horse or something or you know uh, I, I bought this vest at a thrift store for like 10 bucks this hat you know it was probably a good 30 bucks but you know I live streamed quite a bit at the time that was during the pandemic but um, I, I do like the hat, and I actually have a black one as well. So um, if you think that you like, so goes my cat. If you think you'd like to learn how to make hash browns and, and eggs and whatnot, let me know in the comments. Or if you think I should keep on doing this kind of stuff, or you know maybe combine them the two. I remember back in uh, there's some movies some from the 50s or 60s. It was dinosaurs versus cowboys. Well, actually, it was dinosaurs versus aliens. I mean, cowboys versus aliens. I, that's a movie. So, you know, if that could be made into a movie, why can't my channel? I'm not a movie, but why can't, why can't I why can't I find my fan club? I just don't get it. I'm, I'm tired. I'm, I'm really, really tired of bitching about this. I really am. And I'm about to end this channel and then just go do something else and find another hobby. So um, if you like what I'm doing, like and subscribe. Thank you. If you like creating folk art, this is the video for you. Last year, we stopped at our local county fair and shot some photos in the fancy chicken display area, and I decided to try to use these photos as my reference. I should probably use my camera more often since photography is one of my many hobbies besides painting. In this painting, I put two different kinds of chickens in the same composition, each facing each other. I wasn't trying to be photorealistic, but instead a bit folksy and make art my grandma would be proud of to hang in her kitchen. I used acrylic paints on watercolor paper and did my signature underpainting and layering technique. If you're an artist and would like to see more demonstrations on how I paint, try binge watching my YouTube channel. I have a lot more examples of how I do this. When I was done with the painting, I had no plans for it, but my wife wanted to frame it and keep it. It is still sitting in my dining room unframed, but maybe she'll get around to it soon. 
I hope you enjoyed watching me paint these chickens and please like and subscribe to my channel and click the button to see all of my new artwork.